Michael, good morning. Welcome to your virtual tour on the Mitsubishi Triton that you're quiet on. Now, as I mentioned to you in a conversation earlier last night, I'll be going through all the interior and exterior of this car, pointing out any scuff marks or any marks that needs to be noted at first point of sale. Now, before I start the virtual tour for you, Michael, let me just give you a quick tour of my yard here in Cairns if you haven't been here before. Now, where I'm standing, this is one of our two pre-owned dealerships. We hold over 200 plus cars in a given time between two yards here in Cairns, making us one of the biggest pre-owned dealerships here. We've also got across the street there as well, we've got the brand new Toyota showroom and Lexus showroom, service and parts behind it there also. All right, Michael, back to the vehicle now for you. Starting with the front of the car, nice big headlights, daylight driving, blinkers and your fog lights. You've also got the front centers fitted to the vehicle there as well. And as you can see as well, you do have the nice black offset with the vehicle there. Blends in with the orange. You've also got the front camera here as well too. Work your way down. I will point out a little bit of dirt. That will get a detail washing clean. No dramas there at all. A few little dirt marks there as well. I will apologize. It does get a little bit dusty here in Cairns, especially when we have the sh uh, shade cells on top. Any dust up there does fall into the vehicle. So I will point out, it's a little bit dusty, but like the car will get a full detail wash and clean. The clear cut, however, it is in immaculate condition. As you can see, there's no dings, no dents. Clear cut there is immaculate. Work your way down. Front tires, genuine alloys in the black color as well. Genuine 18 inch alloys and plenty, plenty of tread. Looking underneath there, very clean and tidy. Practically still brand new. With such low case. Late model there as well. Blacked out mirrors, blinkers. You've also got the blacked out door handles there as well. It's a very, very nice finish. Black that side steps there as well, just to offset the orange. Jumping up here, genuine Mitsubishi roof rails and racks there as well. So the crossbars, black that roof there as well too. Working your way to the rear, black that sports bar. Black color coded, uh, say black um, hard lead cover there as well for the boot. Back tire, same thing. Genuine alloys, no scuff marks, and plenty of tread left. Well, I got you here. All underneath there. Very clean, very neat and tidy. Moving down. Just a little bit of dirt. Zoom out from this angle here. Work your way to the back of the vehicle. Nice big brake lights. Again, blinkers in your reverse. Black rear step there as well with the rear sensors. And you do have the genuine tow bar there as well with the flat seven. Full size spare underneath. All very clean and tidy there. Reverse camera there as well too, fitted there for you. Also the boot lid cover, it is lockable as well. Apologies a bit hard to try to do it with one hand. You've also got struts there as well for the tailgate. Very, very nice finish. Tub liner, tie downs. Very nice fittings there. Again, Lock to unlock there as well, if needs be, manually. Close that up. Close that up, and a nice big brake lights there as well too. Side view, work your way down. No scuff marks in the back here either. Again, plenty of tread. As 
you can see, the car is immaculate. Just a little scuff mark there, but nothing too major. They'll get, that can get a cut polish if needs be. Overall condition has been very, very well looked after. Slowly making our way back to the front of the car, just to give you that full 360 view. No scuff marks here either. I will point out a little light marks here and same thing that we can get a cut and polish if needs be, no dramas there at all. So there's your exterior of the vehicle. Let's make our way inside the vehicle now, starting with the back seats. Open it up. Leather finish with the orange stitching there as well through. Power windows, speakers, cup holders, and your door handles. And the interior there as well, again, same as the exterior with the orange and black finish. The leather itself, it is in immaculate condition. Three seater, obviously. Genuine floor mats, carpet floors there as well. Phone charger on the back and the roof, all in really good condition. You've got your own controllers there as well for the air con vents here. Very, very nice finish. And the back seats, headrest all in there as well, all in place. Driver side door now, open it up. Power windows, central locking, speakers, cup holders, all in there. Again, with the nice orange stitching and leather trim on the doors. Quite a very stylish looking interior. Airbag on the front seats there as well. As you can see. Electric seats, genuine floor mats, again carpet, push start ignition there as well. Mirrors, adjustable headlights, lane departure assist, traction control all in there for you. Paddle shifts there as well if you can see. Jumping straight in. On the other side there as well. Genuine floor mats, the dash, all in really good condition. Nice touchscreen display, which I'll show you very shortly. And then the windscreen, no chips, no crack or anything at all whatsoever. All right, just fixing up the seat for a sec. Over here, two set of keys, central locking there as well. Owner's manual and your service history booklet. I will show you the services from the first complimentary to the second and then we've just serviced the vehicle there as well. Okay, so your next one isn't due until 30,000 K. So very low case. And you get a reminder up here as well for your next service due. I will also show you, you do have your cap service available on the vehicle there as well. New car warranty expiry is the 24th of the 6th, 2027. Okay, all in there for you, ready to go. Now to start the vehicle, put your foot in the brake and press the start. It's just there. Close the door, start up screen. I think it's just got a little reminder for the maintenance there for the for the service, but it's been done already. So I'll just get the guys to uh, reset the reminder. Uh, but as you can see, 15,000 Ks there on the clock. There's no warning lights besides my handbrake, my seatbelt, okay. Blind spot monitor is on as well, that green light there. Leather steering wheel with the bus with orange as well too, on the stitching. Airbag and horn, Bluetooth, voice command, next track or station, volumes here as well, okay. Cruise control there also. This little button here goes through all the different settings on your screen. All right. Over here, this little button here gives you that full 360 view of the vehicle. All right, gives you that camera on the front there as well side there as well too and back to normal all of a clicker button just there paddle shifts as i mentioned up and down the gears manually if needs be which i'll show you very, very shortly how to use or engage that into the gear automatic headlights very easy to use blinkers and your wipers are on this side moving ahead nice big four air vents touchscreen display okay bluetooth all in there for you as well with the audio, you've got the reverse camera there as well, as I mentioned, you get the 360 degree angle, angle view again. 
aircon, temperature, dual climate control for left and right, okay. Fan speed, AC on, all in there for you. Hazard lights, door indicator. You've also got passenger um, seat belt there as well, indicator. You got the locks there as well for on and off. You've also got the sensors and your blind spot monitor there, there as well too. Two USB, HDMI cord, 12 volt power point, cooling and heated seats there as well. It's a very, very nice finish. Okay. Now, center console, nice bit of orange stitching as well on the side here. Automatic transmission, same goes for the gear stick there as well, all in there for you. Reverse, neutral and drive. And then this setting here for plus and minus. Trip tonic for your manual, I uh, say for your gears on in and out of uh, first gear or second gear. And you can also do it there with the plus and minus on the paddle shift there as well behind the gear stick. Back to park, handbrake. You got here your high gear and your low gear there as well. Okay, very, very easy to use. Cup holders, and again, nice bit of orange stitching there in the handbrake. It's on a console. Nice orange leather. Massive, massive space there as well. And you've got a couple of power points in the, just underneath the bottom there for you. So there's your interior of the of the vehicle. Just going to show you the engine bay of the vehicle now. Just so you can see in here, no funny ticks or noises. Fuel pump. Battery. Check, all been filled up. All right, so there you have your virtual tour on the Mitsubishi Triton. I hope you enjoy, and I'll talk to you soon. Thank you.